What is happening, beautiful people? I'm Tesla. If you're watching the vlog for the first time, welcome. My name is Zaman. What a day, fam! It's been just brutal. It's been non-stop. Been been up since like what six? Straight into work, and it's been just gong show, man. One one thing after another. You know what I mean? I'm just uh, still working away. Uh, typically during my lunch break, I'll start to you know I'll start my podcast. Start you know finish about half of it. And I'll do the rest tomorrow, but I didn't even get started on that, so I may have to work on that tonight. Um, but we'll see how it goes. Still haven't figured out the girls' skating schedules and stuff because I haven't heard back from the skating club. You know, you email them and they just never respond, so I got to figure that out as well. Last night I missed my YouTube mastermind group meeting, which really sucks because I hate missing that. I was just so tied up and I was busy. I was, you know, I was watching tennis for a little bit, and then I got called for work. And um, you know, then I was up till like whatever that was, midnight or something like that before uh, I got to bed so it's just been a busy two days hopefully the rest of the day is relatively you know smooth and no hiccups but we'll see guys what a day so much for you know jinxing um, uh, you know tame evening that's not what happened at all man uh, <laughs> I got called and we had nothing but major problems um, it, it wasn't my problem um, but because the systems touch the security systems and firewalls and proxies and stuff like that, I got dragged into it. So I was sitting on this call um, with a call with a client for what almost three hours now, and um, I'm you know it's just uh, it's just brutal. I'm on hold right now because um, something's going on. So I'll get back on, but um, you know it's it's wow. I just like I'm dying. Honestly, I'm dying. I'm hungry. I'm tired. You know, I want some jaw, you know what I mean? So I can refresh, but um, such is life, man. You know what I mean? Um, at least it's not on a Friday, you know, it's Thursday. So I can, you know, hopefully tomorrow it's not, uh, you know, going to do anything like that. But uh, we'll see how that goes, man. Speaking of which, you know, I'm on call this week. So, you know, i got to remember to, uh, you know, keep my phone on. Because, <laughs> you know, when this happens, you get so mad, you turn your phone off. But you can't do that, you know what I mean? So it is what it is. But uh, I wanted to quickly talk to you guys about um, something that's near and dear to my heart, entrepreneurship. And um, I'm going to have to give some real truths here, man. Um, it's one thing to say you're an entrepreneur, but it's one thing to be an entrepreneur. You know what I mean? It's I'm in these Facebook groups and stuff like that, and I try to bite my tongue, but there's just so much, so much bullshit that goes on with people trying to act and be like entrepreneurs. And I'm sorry, but most of you guys aren't. I'm not saying I'm one. I mean, you know what I mean? That's not what I'm saying. But I know what an entrepreneur is. I know what they look like. I know how they talk. I know how they act, right? You know, I'm, I'm a genuine businessman. Um, and honestly, entrepreneurship is just a sexy word for being in business. You know what I mean? I think the major difference between, you know, having a business and being an entrepreneur is like you are taking that business upon yourself, doing everything, getting it running, your, you know, your your support, your shipping, your receiving, your accounts payable, accounts receivable, whatever. And then once you kind of get into a point where you get off the ground and start hiring people, I think that's when it's you, you start to become a businessman because now you're, you, you know, you're holding down a whole ship. Like you got to, you know, you got employees that you got to take care of. You know what I mean? I think the entrepreneurship is just like you doing everything on your own, getting it to a point. But the point is, man, if you join a Facebook group and... You know, take some sort of course that doesn't make you an entrepreneur. I'm sorry, man. Entrepreneurship is not something that you become in five minutes. It's it's a long history of failing and testing and doing stuff and failing and testing and doing more of that over and over and over again till you finally find a formula that works for yourself, man. You know what I mean? Like it's, you know, yeah, you may open up a business or an LLC or a corporation and what? That makes you an entrepreneur? No, it doesn't. That just makes you a paper pusher. You know what I mean? Like, wow, you successfully were able to form a company. That does not make you an entrepreneur, okay? When you start running a business or running your side hustle, whatever it is, and you're going through the motions, you know what I mean? Like your product gets messed up, your shipping is screwed up. Like, look at me. I had a hell of a time trying to get my product into Amazon in the US. You know, it was like delays from the factory, there was like this and that, and shipping was expensive, went to different shipping forders, and I was like this, I like, I spent money on getting like pictures taken, and like, you know, so much stuff, I spent money on trying to get someone to do a, a listing for me on Amazon, like there's so much stuff that I was doing while I was running 
my my core business, right? My IT security company. You know what I mean? So it, it's it, you got to be in the thick of things, man. You got to be right in there. You got to be hustling. That's what entrepreneurship is, man. That's what's running a business is. It's not like joining a Facebook group and say, hey guys, you know, I'm new to entrepreneurship and I want to be an entrepreneur. That's not how it works. You know, that's great. You want to be an entrepreneur, but you got to act like it. You got to talk like it. You got to sleep it. You got to, you know, you got to, you just got to, you got to be all in. And, and I hate to say it, man, but most of you just aren't. And some of you that think you're entrepreneurs, you're not. It's just, it's just the way it is. That's not to say, you know, you know, you're watching, also watching this thing to myself. Well, he's full of shit, man. I am an entrepreneur. That's totally cool. Right. If you think you're not entrepreneur, you know, good for you, man. But at the end of the day, you can think all you want. It's all about actions and what you do. That's what I'm, that's what I'm trying to say. Right. It doesn't matter what I say. It doesn't matter what your neighbor says or your mom or your dad. It doesn't matter what they say. At the end of the day, actions speak louder than words and you got to execute. You know what I mean? Like I get all this, oh, you know, I want a visualization board and you need to visualize this and visualize that. Yeah, that's great. But if you're not doing the work and just thinking about it all the time, like what are you actually accomplishing? You know what I mean? Like I will take someone any day, every day, someone who is going out to hustle, makes mistakes, learns from it, improves and just keep going step by step. Just one foot over the other than some smart ass um, who's got this massive visualization board, thinks he's an entrepreneur, but has never, never done anything in their life any day of the week man it's all about actions like i learned from making thousands of mistakes and i'm going to make more i'm going to continue to make more i already know i made mistakes you know with my first product i'm launching into amazon and ebay and whatever it is i already know i made mistakes and I, you know and there's stuff beyond my control and there's stuff that i'm gonna have to fix you understand what i'm saying so you know what if you call yourself an entrepreneur that's awesome but you got to be one you got to act like one Right, you gotta be in the thick of things, like I said, man. It's one thing to say you're one, but you know, you got—I don't know, like it's just like you know, I can say I'm a mechanic all day or an Air Force pilot or whatever, right? You see me flying planes around? No, you know, like I, yeah, I've got tools, but I ain't no mechanic. Like I can maybe, you know, change a spark plug or something like that, but I'm no mechanic by far. So saying that you're a mechanic and actually being a mechanic are two different things. That's all I'm saying, right? So if you want to be an entrepreneur, that's great, man. The world needs more. The world needs more entrepreneurs. They need more leaders. You know, they need more business people. Do it. Go out and crush it. You know, and you gotta, you gotta, you gotta keep learning. And it's not that difficult to be an entrepreneur. Like, you know, anyone can be an entrepreneur. Whether or not you're a talented one, that's a separate conversation. You gotta start somewhere, and you gotta start by learning. You gotta start by reading stuff. You gotta start by, you know, building that bulletproof mindset. Because without it. Saying you're an entrepreneur, I guarantee you, most of you, like, you know, 70, 60, a good high percentage of you are going to hit your first hurdle, right? Like I launched my, you know, I launched my product and my family didn't buy it. That's it. You know, this doesn't work. And you're going to start blaming everybody else except for yourself for your problems. It's just the way life works. It's always easier to blame other people, but you can't, but you never look at yourself. You understand what I'm saying? So that's all I'm saying. So guys, I do apologize for today's vlog. Um, I wasn't out and about doing stuff, but I really want to get that, you know, hammered into you guys that um, you got to be real. You got to be authentic. You got to continue to learn. You got to make mistakes. You got to, you know, learn from those mistakes, fall down hard, get back up and keep going. That's what entrepreneurs are. It's not someone who just one day puts up on their Facebook post. Hey, I'm an entrepreneur today. That's not how it works. You understand what I'm saying? Fam, man. Eh. Oh, heads are not... Uh pretty tired as well um that was a long call was like four hours and like i said it wasn't my issue it's gonna wind down the night gonna watch a little bit of tv i don't get to watch much but see what's on just to kind of wind down and i'll edit the vlog that you're watching you know later on or maybe tomorrow tomorrow is friday guys you know how i feel about friday even though you know people switch off at like noon don't do that make sure you end friday strong that we don't have anything else to worry about over the weekend and coming Monday to work, you know, you've had a really strong week. So, you know, you're a step ahead. Like, you know, the discussion was having about entrepreneurship. And, uh, you know, if you're an entrepreneur or not, I'll tell you one thing, though, man. Businessmen and entrepreneurs, they don't uh, they don't rest. Um, and they don't leave stuff that's minuscule for another day. They get shit done. Um, that's my motto is to get shit done. And you guys should do the same thing. I'm not sure what's happening tomorrow in terms of uh, after work. I think we're just chilling out. Um, weekend, same thing. I really want to, you know, focus on getting some of that stuff um, sold again. Uh, you know, my products. I gotta 
figure out some, uh, you know, email funnels and stuff like that so I can get that prepared and uh, start doing some giveaways and stuff like that for my products. So there's a whole bunch of stuff I got to do. And uh, it's funny. This is the entrepreneur life, man. You know, you got to do stuff first till you start making some money, then hire someone else to do it. You know what I mean? So, yeah, so it's going to be an interesting uh, next few weeks. I'm looking forward to it. Um, I'm pretty excited about it. But I want to say if you're watching the vlog for the first time, no, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Please subscribe to the family. If you want to see more vlogs just like this, please click on Beyond the Sky. Of course, to my peeps, be you. Stay optimistic. Enjoy the rest of your night. This is a big high five for me. Close.